Hello my friends, welcome again. In this video we are going to work with the installed Laravel 8 in a Docker container. And first of thing, you need to go to the des Docker desktop and install the application. After installing, run it in your machine and in my case is here. Okay. I have one install it up, go to the Laravel, getting started, installation, and so after you have installed the Docker and is running, just copy the command and go to the terminal. Okay, navigate your directory where you want to install the application and hit that command and hit enter or you if you want you can change the the name just I'm going to leave it just an example hit enter and for the first time it's going to take a couple of minutes okay and after this, uh, after this is installing, you will navigate to the application and run this vendor's bin sale app. But I'm going to show you one more thing. If you go to the sale, you have if you have the existing application, you you can uh, install with Composer, but you, you, if you want to make an alias of this, because you don't want to write any any time slash vendor slash bin slash sales. So go to the bash uh, the profile or in my case zsrc and insert that alias I have been I have created but just to show you okay here you see and after this you don't need this uh, anymore sale vendor said but just sale up or in better you do this say lab dash d to run it in bank in background and if i go here now i th uh, i think we are ready okay pass the password and okay we are ready to so cd to this copy and pass and run this vendor sale bin been sale up or in my case because I have make an alias just sale up or dash d to run in the background okay and if I make this uh, I have another application so sale down for because I have another application now the example up because I have opened this and sail down sorry sail down here because if I go okay I'm going to show you why I do this with my dashboard. Now, see, uh, navigate to the application we installed together, sale, 
not sale but CD so CD example and now sale up and now here it's going to run the application example okay okay it's running and now if I go here to the local health is our application and to show you we are inside this application I'm going to open with a code okay here we are so inside the roads views I'm going to make a change here HTML and H1 hello from Laravel 8 Dockerize save this okay refresh now okay. we are inside this one more thing so if I go to the terminal and I want to make a artisan command or composer or npm so we need to run this sale and artisan for example artisan migrate and it migrate the database and for composer sale composer and install something or sale npm and install or run dev okay so if you are inside the documentation of sale and go so executing php commands sale before after the php and executing composer command sale and composer and executing the npm and not sale sale node and sale npm and if you want if you don't want to run the to write that the sale and artisan but you want php artisan you can do this sale shell and now you are inside the shell and your php artisan migrate fresh for example and you can do that's a thing okay command editor and uh, one more thing I want to show you inside this we have the the mild hog because if I go here inside the env dot nv file we have the inside the mild host the mail hook okay and the port not 1025 board but uh, 8025 I think yeah mail hook and you can make a example to send email or whatever you want okay that's it for this video thank you and see you in next one